Today I want to talk about uh, jobs in uh, Linux. Now if you are interested in uh, Linux and you want to make your career in this particular field, the most common thing that you can do or if you search yourself online, you will come across a lot of jobs about Linux system administrator. And this is perfectly fine. I think uh, if you're happy with this, then why not? Go ahead. But I want to talk about something else in this video. I think you should try to create a career around something that uh, no one else is uh, doing, something or some uh, specific uh, uh, field within uh, Linux. Now, talking about jobs, personally, I want to share a job or uh, a career around training. Yes, training. Now, there is something really interesting about uh, training or education in general. You will never be uh, out of business or you will never be out of demand because at any given point, even in the future, there will be people, maybe in colleges, in school, students basically, or maybe if you're talking about corporates, they will always uh, be looking to learn Linux or things around uh, Linux. There are a lot of things that uh, you can uh, learn, not just about uh, the Linux itself, but uh, uh, there are things like uh, certifications, there are things uh, uh, talking about specific uh, distributions, for example, and uh, people start with Reddit certification, which is definitely the most common certification in the market. Now, if you consider becoming a trainer, or maybe uh, you consider maybe starting your own business around uh, providing trainings to other uh, uh, people, then you have a lot of options. Number one, you can uh, train uh, maybe school kids, you can train online, you can maybe create your own courses, maybe you can create uh, videos like this and maybe you can uh, create a video course on uh, Udemy or maybe you can just create a YouTube channel like I am doing. Uh, but you will always find someone who is uh, interested in uh, learning these things, uh, especially in colleges. Usually if you go to any engineering college, you will find uh, students IT students, engineering computer science students, they have to learn Linux. It is part of their curriculum. And these uh, students, these uh, uh, kids, they always uh, are looking for uh, doing some extra courses or maybe some certification programs. So if you have this uh, skill of, or if you develop this skill of training others, then in my opinion, this is a uh, an evergreen uh, job and you will always be in demand. And if you search online about uh, Linux trainers, I can guarantee that uh, there is definitely a shortage. Not many people can teach. Uh, it is not really about teaching a skill, but it is also about uh, teaching skills. So you will not really find a lot of uh, good Linux trainers or teachers. So this is something that I thought uh, I will uh, share with all of you. And I'm talking about this because uh, I used to do the same thing. When I uh, started my freelancing career, I used to train others uh, on Linux, apart, apart from, of course, doing a Linux consultation. I used to set up Linux servers for other companies. And I did that for quite a while, but apart from that, I also used to train others. And I think it is a, a really good way to, uh, of course, make a career, but uh, you will always be in touch with uh, you know the latest things because when you're training others, you have to be always uh, up to date. Of course, you can also do uh, maybe system admin, services, maybe you, let us say, are, maybe let us say you are a freelancer. So you can maybe have a portfolio of different things that you can do for other people like uh, 
of course, training and helping others in uh, getting certified. But uh, if given a choice, I think you should also keep this option of uh, system administration uh, open because maybe someone will contact you for uh, doing this particular work. But I just wanted to share that uh, if you are trying to build a career, then becoming a trainer is also a very good option. And that is all I wanted to share in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much.